है प्रभु वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस आर्थ्रोपोड्स आर्थ्रोपोड इज द फाइलम ऑफ इनवर्टिब्रेट्स एंड दिस इज द लार्जेस्ट फाइलम ऑफ द एनिमल किंगडम वॉट डू मीन बाय आर्थ्रोपोड्स आर्थ्रोपोड मीन्स जॉइंटेड फिट और लेग द एनिमल विच आर हैविंग जॉइंटेड लेग्स are called as arthropods these are the many pictures from the arthropods the examples this is the millipede the centipede these are the butterfly and here the beetles and the dragon fly this is honey bee and the bugs moth the spider well known spider is this and uh, the uh, bugs are here one more picture is the of uh, scorpion and this is the king crab this king crab having the uh, very peculiar characteristics in that it doesn't show the evolution again here i am giving crab and uh, of course the beetles here. we will see general characters of phylum arthropoda the first character is the animals they are having segments and uh, their appendages are jointed and the paired one their exoskeleton is made up of from the chitin which is shedding after time to time the body is divided into head thorax and the abdomen it is called cephalization and in some animal the head and thorax they fuse together to form the cephalothorax eyes are compound or the simple the body cavity is called as cilia and the circulatory system is open type and the ventral nerve cord is present see this is the figure showing you that this is the nervous system located behind the elementary canal this is elementary canal lateral view of the animal arthropod this is the dorsal side the ventral side and actual this is the pick of honey bee the spider is here showing cephalothorax see this is the cephalothorax the head and the thorax they are fused together and the abdomen they are present separately so this is shown you that how the metamerism or segmentation of the body is there about respiration in these animals the animal respire through the trachea and gills in some animals book lungs are present for example in the scorpion fertilization is taking place internally excretion is takes place with the help of green glands and the malpighian tubules in some animal coxal glands are also there and they show male and female separately known as sexual dimorphism some animals show parthenogenesis that is the reproduction takes place without fertilization development usually indirect means there are many larva and the animal taking care known as parental care many pairs of jaws in the head region is present and known as labrum labium maxilla and the mandible see this is how the uh, animal parasitized on the another animal this is the crab ventral side 
and the again another arthropod parasitized this crab from the ventral side. The special character of the arthropod is they are adapted to live in anywhere in the water, on the land or in the air and about 80% of the animal kingdom occupies by this phylum arthropoda. They survive in the very high temperature, toxic and acidity or the salinity environment and uh, the evolved from they are evolved from the peripetus so this is the picture of the peripetus and the peripetus is the connecting link between the annelid as well as the arthropod they use the pheromones to communicate see the ants they are moving in a single line we see that this is the best example that movement of the ant and this movement is uh, takes place with the help of pheromones. Actually, the pheromones, they are secreted by each and every animal. They have their different pheromones. So, this is about some external characteristics of the arthropod.